This footage shows a terrifying accident from May of 1983. It's an Israeli F-15D flying above the Negev desert with only one wing. The aircraft pilot Ziv Nadivi just recovered the jet from a tight spiral after colliding with an A-4 Skyhawk and was being ordered to eject. With runway almost in sight, only 10 miles away, however Nadivi lit his afterburners and headed to attempt the most unconventional landing. Before the accident, the aircraft took down four enemy planes during 1992 of Lebanon war. On its second run, took down MiG-23 in Syria on November 19, 1985. The plane flown during the practice over the Negev was an F-15D, a two-seat training version of which 92 were built between 1979 and 1985. The other plane involved was a Douglas A-4 Skyhawk, a single-seater subsonic light attack plane. The accident took place on May 1, 1983. The Israeli Air Force was carrying out their divergent air combat training session over the Negev. An F-15 crash into an A-4 Skyhawk after both planes approached each other too closely and their undersides collided. The Skyhawk plane caught on fire, the pilot immediately ejected, he was able to parachute to land safely. Ziv didn't even realize what had gone wrong. At first, he simply felt a big push and saw the fireball caused by the exploding Skyhawk. He heard the radio communication informing that the pilot was successfully ejected. F-15 Eagle began rolling uncontrollably, its right wing dislocated about two feet from its root. Still both crew members aboard the airplane were oblivious, the leaking fuel stream out of the wing vaporizing, as in the wing attachment which cover the view of the missing wing. Only after descending into a tight spiral did the pilot notice the missing key component. Ziv Nadivi gained control of the aircraft without realizing the full extent of the damage. He switched afterburners on, which at least halted the spin. The two crew members were ordered to eject, but instead they tried to save the airplane by landing at the nearest airfield 10 miles away. Due to the lift from the fuselage, stabilizer, and the left wing, the jet remained stable. Nadivi diverted to Ramon Air Base. The F-15 landed at 260 knots, twice the average speed to maintain lift during a standard landing. The tail hook was consequently destroyed. With high precision and a bit of luck, Nadivi was able to stop the plane only 20 feet from the airfield barrier. About his decision to land, Nadivi later said that he, quote, probably would have ejected if I knew what had happened. In fact, the pilot only learned of their severe wing damage after inspecting the aircraft upon landing. The F-15 Eagle with the missing wing labeled as 106 Squadrons of Markia Shakim, Hebrew for Skyblazer. It was sent to Tel Nof at the Israeli Air Force Maintenance Unit. It underwent two months of repairs. Showing the F-15 extreme strength and reliability, the jet was soon restored entirely. It returned to normal service. Thank you very much for watching. I would like to kindly ask you to smash that like button and to subscribe to my channel because it will help my channel and also it will make me very happy. Also, I would like to ask you to leave a comment. I read them all. Let me know what your thoughts are and if there is a specific subject you would like me to talk about, I will do my best and try to make a video on it. Fly safe.